your boy Papa Q, aka Quan. I am back with another video, man. And as y'all can see by the title and the thumbnail, I am bringing you guys another tutorial. And today's tutorial is how to make the horn. Fitted. As y'all know, if you follow me on Instagram, I posted a few flicks with a horn fitted. I've got multiple DMs and comments on where did I get my hat from, who did I get my hat from, and or how did I make my hat. And I like doing tutorials on my channel because like it was once upon a time where I wanted to learn how to make the horn fitted and it was no tutorials on YouTube. So I just sat there, learned how to make it myself, and now I'm bringing the tutorial for y'all. So with that being said, man, I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. And before we hop into today's video, I actually don't have any materials to make the horn hat. So we're gonna go run to Walmart, pick up the materials. I'm gonna show y'all everything y'all need. Yeah, let's go. Right, so we have made it to Walmart, and for the first material that you need is, of course, is of course the fabric. How you gonna make the horn hat with no horns? You gotta make the horns from scratch. So I was originally gonna do a blue hat, but they don't have no blue fabric like the same as I need. So I'm gonna just go with brown. And I don't think I'm supposed to buy this whole thing, but I don't see nobody over there to come cut it. So. I'm gonna just grab the whole damn shit. If y'all want some brown fucking yarn or whatever that is, let me know in the comments down below. I got y'all. The second thing you do indeed need is a stick handle. I thought this was a call a cutter. I don't know what this shit is called, but this is what you need for the second item. Or you can use scissors, but I recommend this because it makes your cuts more precise. If you're not good with using scissors and I'm not that good, I'd rather use that and have a better cut. So that is the second item you need. Now let's go ahead and move on to the third. Alright, y'all, for the third item, you do need indeed something to fill the horns with. So, this is what I recommend Polyfit Premium Polyester Fiber Fill. It's like cotton almost. And they got bigger bags, but I mean, I'm just making one hat, so I'm gonna grab this. This is the smallest bag they have. And I'm gonna tell y'all the total price of everything added up all together once I'm checking out. For the last and final item, you do indeed need. A hot glue gun. I was recommended to try a hot glue gun, so this will be my first time trying it as well as teaching y'all. So if all goes right, hopefully our hat will come out nice. And in order to use a hot glue gun, you do indeed need hot glue sticks. So I'm just grab one bag. It's two dollars. I'm just grab one bag. I think that should be good. But before for my red horn hat, I had used um, super glue, fabric glue. I, this is exactly what I used. I had used adhesive fabric super fabric adhesive glue and it worked good but it had like little runny stuff on the side but people don't, you can't really see it unless somebody my nigga looks on top of your hat and be like what is that white stuff on your hat it's not even white it's just like clear almost y'all know what glue looks like so yeah with that being said this is all you need to make the horn fitted and of course you also need the fitted cap but i already have that so with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and check out and i will catch you guys once i get back to the house all right so i am back at home and now it's time to actually make the horn fitted but i did indeed tell you i was going to tell the price of everything it costs to make the fitted so i got my receipt right here and as y'all know you all you already know you need a fitted hat and the fitteds are like 44 dollars 45 dollars plus tax that's you know what i'm saying everybody got fitted so if you watch the video nine times out of ten you got a fitted then you know what i'm saying you got the fiber fill the polyester this was four dollars got you know what i'm saying your fabric this came up to be $15 just because I bought four yards of it. I didn't feel like waiting on a lady to measure the thing. So it's the full four yards. When you're in Walmart, you're actually supposed to wait on a lady to get this cut. But I didn't feel like it, so I bought the whole thing. If any one of y'all wants some fucking brown fabric, get out. Next up on the list, we do indeed have, you know what I'm saying, glue sticks. The glue sticks was indeed $3. $3 for glue sticks. Then you need this next tool I showed y'all. This little, you know what I'm saying, cutter. It looked like a pizza cutter. I ain't gonna lie. As y'all can see, get a little close up on that. That is everything. Like I said before, you also need your fitted hat. And this is the fitted I will be doing. It's a brown fitted. I'm going to take off the spikes on the fitted because I'm making horns now. And yeah. And also, we got a, you know what I'm saying, we got a little issue. These aren't the same brown. So if, I, if you're doing this, I suggest you to bring the hat that you're making to, you know what I'm saying, Walmart. Make sure it's the right color fabric because this brown and this brown is not the same thing. The gun was $2. And a lot of y'all in the comments be saying, um... You worship the devil, this and that. My nigga, it's just a hat. Get out your feelings, my nigga. It's a fucking hat. So with that being said, man, we got this. I'm letting it, I'm letting the um hot glue gun heat up. And once that heats up, I'm gonna get back at y'all. Matter of fact, while the hot glue gun is heating up, let's go ahead and start cutting our fabric. Alright, y'all. So now it is time to actually make the horns. You know what I'm saying? You gotta make the horns from scratch. A lot of people was asking, can I just buy the horns? No, you can't buy the horns. That's the point of it. You know what I'm saying? Me having all this, I'm looking for the horn hat, but it shit is on my head. Alright, so look, since I already have a horn hat, I'm just gonna, you know what I'm saying, eyeball it and I'm just gonna write out how big I want my horns. I'm basically gonna trace the horn on this fabric. But if you don't have, you know what I'm saying, a horn hat already, you could just eyeball it and just draw your own horn. You could Google a horn, you could print out a horn. As long as you have, you know what I'm saying, the right size. Also, another thing, when you're cutting your fabric, 
have it folded so you don't have to cut it multiple times so once you cut it it'll just be all four pieces and you don't got to go back and recut it so we're gonna lay this you know what i'm saying we flipped it over we're gonna lay it like here as you can see we got one layer two layer and then the two layers under here so yeah man with that being said you have you know what i'm saying your fabric laid out is ready now it is time to draw the actual horns and like i said before i'm just gonna eyeball it so cut me some slack if you can't draw you know what i'm saying you got a big ass piece of fabric so feel free to you know what i'm saying try again but i'm just gonna freehand it as y'all can see that horn kind of skinny so i ain't gonna use that one let's try again man, it's like my nigga it's all practice my nigga you can be bored at the house trying some shit you could probably can come up with some fly shit that's probably better than horns but look here's the thing also you have to make it big enough because you have to fill it up with you know what i'm saying the polyester so i'm gonna keep, try this one more time my nigga third time's the charm i'm doing this with one hand by the way so cut me some slack i have some big ass horns that doesn't look like a horn i'm gonna try this off camera and i'm gonna get back to y'all once i get my horn <laughs> y'all so got the horns cut out as y'all can see they obviously not perfect my nigga because my nigga i'm not the most perfect nigga in the world but as y'all can see you know what i'm saying i did what i could do and you could you know what i'm saying keep trying to get you the most perfect precise fucking horn but my nigga, at the end of the day i'm just trying to show y'all what to do and how to make so you know what i'm saying got my horns cut out and actually i'm gonna recut these now look at it this shit is like, like a triangle and this is like a horn so i'm gonna actually recut them but this is how they will look once they're done you know what i'm saying you need two of each side because you, you know what I'm saying? You got to put them together. I'm, we're going to get into that later. Let me go ahead and fix these horns. Give me a second. I'll be right back. All right, y'all. Ten horns later, my nigga. I finally got the horns. So, as y'all see, you know what I'm saying? Got the most perfect horns that you can possibly make. So, now that you got this, you want to have your, you know what I'm saying? Hot glue gun over here heating up. So, once you got your horns, now it is time for this to come into play. I'm about to set the camera up and show y'all what you got to do with this. All right, y'all. What the fuck? All right, now it's time to put the horns together. As y'all can see, you know what I'm saying? Got my horns laid out in front of me. Y'all may be wondering, how the hell are we about to put the horns together? That's where the glue stick and the glue gun comes in hand. What you're going to need to do, my nigga, get this cotton open up. We're just going to grab a slight little handful. And if y'all ain't know, yes, this is what's in the horns. All right, so now that we got, the, now that we got you know what I'm saying, our cotton. I feel like a teacher. This shit crazy. All right, now that we got our cotton. Bro. The glue doesn't fit into the glue gun. Look at this shit. The glue gun is too small. Once you glue it, don't glue the bottom because that's, you're gonna need that to be open so you can insert the polyester. As y'all see, first side glued together. Just pull all this excess glue off. Now it's time to do the second side. And as y'all see, you got all like this little glue marks. You can clean that up after, you know what I'm saying, your thing is glued together. Let's go ahead and glue this side. The only thing, the thing about the hot glue gun is the glue dries type fast. That's what I like about the hot glue gun. Over the adhesive. Adhesive, it took like 10 minutes each to dry. All right, so now, we, now that I have my horns done, as y'all can see, two horns are complete, my nigga. Y'all can cut all that excess, you know what I'm saying, glue off if you want to, but me, I'm chilling. Now it is time to actually stuff each horn. So, like I said before, I don't even think I need all of this. Just take a little bit, buy a little bit, and then start stuffing it into each horn as just as shown. The hardest part about making a horn hat is making a horn. Putting it on there isn't that, isn't that hard. Just keep stuffing the horn. And the rest of this tutorial should be self-explanatory, but I'm just gonna do this just to show y'all. If I was to stop it right here, niggas gonna be in the comments like, bro, what happened? All right, so from here, all you're gonna wanna do is stuff the horn as shown. Just put the stuff in, or just put the polyester into the horn and you can make it as full as you want. And your horn should come out somewhat like this. Like I said before, you can cut out all the excess glue. But I'm gonna continue filling both of my horns and, I I'm, gonna, and I'm gonna get back to y'all once they're both filled. All right, y'all, so after about 30 minutes or so, I have perfected my horns, as y'all can see. You know what I'm saying? Cool look. It's not perfect, but you know what I'm saying? It look better than what it did before. This one, I ain't gonna lie. This shit kind of raunchy, but this is as good as it's gonna get just for this tutorial. So, after you got your two horns, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna want to open your head up and see how you want to place them. And for me, I like it like, I would want to place them like this, as y'all see. I place my... 
I went based off of my other horn hat. And as y'all can see, it's placed behind the second hole in the front. So I'm gonna do the same for this one. Basically just gonna place it right here. And I'm gonna get the hot gluing around, you know what I'm saying? The thing, and like I said before, it's not the same color brown, sadly. I thought it was, but it's not. But we're gonna make it work. So, gonna start hot gluing this onto this. And yeah, with that being said, let's go. You know what I'm saying? Got this just like this. What you're gonna wanna do is start hot gluing the bottom of the horn around the whole thing and make it fast because this hot glue dries up quick in a hurry. So, got that. Now, let's place it on the hat as right, so. As y'all can see, it's drying mad fast. Just gonna give it a few seconds, you know what I'm saying? Count of 10, cool little quick little 10. And that is that. As y'all can see, your horn is placed on your fitted. This is not the perfect horn. It's not the best looking horn, but it's a horn just for the sake of this tutorial. As y'all can see, so we got this horn. I'm gonna try to play with the placement, but yeah, that looks, it's just as good as this one. All right, y'all, so first horn on, as y'all can see, and it looks skinnier than this one, but it, we just, it's still cool, you know what I'm saying? Y'all just gotta play with it yourself and make the perfect horn. I wasn't about to sit here and make the perfect horn. I made it look as good as I possibly could, but that is the first horn. Now it is time to place the second one. But this is that, let's go ahead and hop straight into the next horn. Now we're gonna line this up and make sure it's even with the sec with the first horn. This is how this look. For anybody that was wondering, put the glue on the outer liner. And I'm just gonna place this on the hat before it dries, just as so. All right, y'all, so after the long awaited trials and tribulations, after me fucking with the glue, after me trying to make my glue stick smaller because it fit, because it couldn't fit into the goo gun, the goo gun, the glue gun, from me trying to make the perfect horn. After all that, we have finally made the final product, and I'm about to show y'all the final product. And I want y'all to DM me y'all horn fitteds on Instagram after y'all make them. But as y'all can see, like I said before, it's not the same color brown. But yeah, this is indeed the final product, as y'all can see. You can play with the placements on the fitted if you would like. But this is how mine's look. DM me how y'all's look on Instagram at PoppyQ. But man, that's gonna wrap up today's video. If you guys enjoyed any bit of it, hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. It's your boy PoppyQ, aka Quan. Cuz might be the game, and I'm out. That's none of my business. I'll be fast, let me fast, let me purple sipping.